We're coming to you live with a quick DIY one for our video. Well, here I have a Dell R610 server. As you can see right there, let me just zoom in, try to focus. There it is. And the problem is I want to add a graphics card to this server. So here's a graphics card. It's a PCIe Express graphics card. That is PCIe X16 graphics card, but looking at this Dell R610 server, it will only accept a PCIe Express 8 graphics card. So there is a problem here. Hmm. Well, guess what, guys? I have a theoretical solution, and I say that because I purchased this item off eBay from China. It took about a month to get here, and interestingly this is a converter to convert from a PCIe Express 8 slot to a PCIe X16 slot so with this I theoretically should be able to install this graphics card in this Dell R610 server and get it to work so I'm going to give it a test and see what happens. This is my lab server, but I want to get some improved graphics out of it. I may even use it on my YouTube channel as well, uh, or do other things with it. But as you know, the built-in graphics card is not very good. So I'm going to try it. I'm thinking it may work. I'm not sure yet. I guess time will tell. I'm going to install it right now. And this should fit here nicely. And let's just stick it in there. Alright. I'm going to install it right there. Come right back. Because I need both hands. Okay, there it is. It's been installed in the PCIe X8 slot. So now all I have to do is insert the graphics card. And very interesting. Alright, well this Dell server has intrusion detection built in it and of course you have to put the cover on for the server to cool properly and of course now I can just put this graphics card over here like this so I can close the server and it looks like it doesn't need any additional power at least it's not telling me that so we'll see what happens let's just pop it in and see how it goes well, there she sits. Check that out. The graphics card has been installed. And this is an ATR Rodian graphics card. I removed this from an old PC. So, I'm just going to set it out like this and see what happens. I'm going to give it a test. I'm going to put the cover back on the server. And pop it on and see if it works. Alright, here is the graphics card outside the server. And I'm going to plug the power in the server right now and just see what happens. See if this fan spins. I guess this will be the real test, right? So let's just plug it in. Plug the power in and you should hear some loud noise right now. Alright. And check that out. The graphics card is indeed spinning. So it looks like guys it's getting sufficient power so this is very encouraging at least from this standpoint so I'm thinking this PCI e Express 16 graphics card is gonna work inside of the server using the PCI e X8 adapter so let's see what happens so far so good Everything sounds great. All four drives are spinning. The server is up and um, this is my ESXi server. The graphics card is still spinning, the fan is still spinning, so this is very encouraging. I have a feeling this is going to work. So maybe it is well worth the month that I waited to receive it so guys let's jump to the server and see what happens 
Okay guys, it appears that the adapter has worked. That is the PCIe X8 to X16 Express adapter that I bought from China. It has worked because that is my graphics card right there. Um, and it's, de it's de detected by the system. And that's the, the AMD Optiplex 980 graphics card and um, of course it's, um, it's detected by the system so that is awesome so yep that, that adapter has worked and I think this is going to work out well for my application and uh, I plan to give it a test drive um, maybe installing a game on this uh, machine a virtual machine running a game or something like that but yep the adapter has worked so I think so far so good and only time will tell if it does hold up. I think I may install this graphics card in a little case later on I may build something for it but for right now it's outside it, it has a cooling fan it's doing just fine so there you have it guys um, in, in case you have a Dell R610 server and you want to add a graphics card then this is the way to go. Anthony coming to you live and I chat you next time. If you like this video give a thumbs up. See you later.